Hey everyone, welcome to Reignite Health. My name is Box. I'm a bioconetist that has an interest in educating you about health and wellness. But today I'm going to go a little bit off that track and speak about my life, my journey after I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. And specifically, I want to tell you more about my experience on the medication known as Mavenclad. I do have a video on it when I just finished my um, my dosage for the second year. So please do click the link to see that video. And now this is year three post taking the medication and year four since I started the medication. And I want to give you guys just an update on how the past few years have been, my experiences, everything that I've done to stay healthy and just elevate my life. All right, let's get into the video. Based on my understanding, Mavenclad is a targeted immunosuppressant, which means that it targets specific immune cells that are programmed for MS that and to kill those cells in hopes to not have too many of those cells and decrease the amount of relapses that you could have or the progression of the disease so this is taken in two bouts you have 12 pills in the first year six in one month six in a month later and then a year later you have another six in one month six in a, a month later so overall 24 pills that you take over the course of two years and then that's it. You just live. You wait. You wait for life. You wait for life to start once your immune system builds again. So the only downfall about it is that it does kill the immune system quite a bit. And by that, I mean it drops it, which means that your chances for infections are higher in that period. And then once you're done with the medication course, you can build your immune system again and eventually be healthy and well. Some people can go a year, two years, three years, five years, a lifetime without having to take MS medication anymore. Um, but yeah, it all depends on you and what you do to manage the condition. So when I took the medication, it was during COVID uh, in 2020, like four months after COVID started. My body was like, let's go on Mavenclad and let's just put you in a longer isolation and deal with it. And then again in 2021, my experiences on the medication were mainly fatigue and more infections. I did isolate during that period. So my chances of getting COVID then was much less because I wasn't exposed. Um, literally at all, I was at home 24 seven, didn't go to the shops, nothing. Um, but little little infections such as a um, sinus infection, allergies, common cold, all of that is stuff that I would get regularly during that period. But yeah, the biggest symptom that I that I dealt with was uh, fatigue. I was just really tired. I know there's a bit of a mental part that has to play with that. Reason being is that I was stuck at home all the time and just. The stress of COVID and all of that just has an effect on your mental well-being. And one of the symptoms of depression, anxiety, all of that is being tired. So I was tired from two different things, physically and mentally. So lots of sleeping, lots of resting, lots of enjoying just, or trying to enjoy being at home. But then came 2021 post medication about four months after i took the medication as i had to wait for my immune system to build up again i was free yes i could go to the depths of the world i could do the any things that i wanted to do without anyone having to say anything about covid about this about that about health or whatever i could be a normal normal citizen of south africa and that is exactly what I did. Obviously, staying with the precautions, wearing the masks and all that we had to do, my my um, risk was still there for COVID like everyone else. 
but my ability to fight it or to to prevent getting it or getting a severe version of it was much stronger so 2022 started working for myself i'm self-employed i'm a bioneticist i have my own practice and started helping more people just take control of their health using this experience to do that i was elevated by the fact that i don't have to take uh, medication anymore in these past three years post Mavenclad, i've managed to decrease anxiety medication as well which has gone from like when i was first diagnosed in in 2014 it's gone from like a handful of pills a day for everything to now only taking one pill a day so i really have made a huge change with regards to that and Mavenclad did help me with that with that process and helping me understand my body more helping me realize what my body needs for nourishment and helping me really work towards improving my health all around i also decreased a lot of supplements that i was on and really just started this new health journey my energy improved a lot i could manage to get through days more easily allergies became way less i get sick maybe once a year like like it's really changed in the past i was sick every day headaches uh, stomach issues sinuses now over the past few years it's mainly just been like you know the common cold flu for about a month of the year and then the rest of the time i'm all good if i do get sick as well i manage to heal myself quickly and naturally which I couldn't do in the past. In the past, I'd have to go to antibiotics and all of that to heal. So it really has, I would like to say for me, it really has strengthened my immune system in a different way. But over this time of being on Mammoth Clad and changing my life and everything, I managed to improve its, its effectiveness in my body, in, in improving my health, my immune system by all the other lifestyle changes that I made. So cutting out inflammatory foods from my diet, uh, so no gluten, no dairy, no sugar, anything I'm allergic to or subtly allergic to, cut those out as well. Started meditating, started yoga, started walking, started exercising, oh, you name it. I did everything from a holistic point of view to try and improve and better the effectiveness of the mammon clad so as much as it did do a lot for me i also did a lot to allow it to do a lot for me if if that makes sense and it was really just an elevating experience for me currently as it stands i have had another scan and there is possibly a new lesion which means that the medication for me is lasting about three four years and so i might need to go back on it if i do it will allow me to experience it in a different way that that being that um it's post covid i don't have to isolate and all of that so understanding how the medication works in normal everyday life will be better for me to tell you guys about but hopefully that we don't have to get to that point and that everything i do from a holistic point of view will calm the ms and keep me healthy and well so yeah symptoms of ms that i normally get have been pretty much non-existent i do have memory problems here and there and weakness here and there but i'm playing volleyball again i'm socializing again my energy has improved i'm actually making it through the day more easily i'm drinking less coffee to make it through the day i'm busy studying my masters now as well and i'm managing a business and i'm managing to do that all perfectly well but it has to do with how I've elevated my life from a holistic point of view as well as using Maven Clad. So if it is in the cards for you, I would say, you know, check your options, maybe go for it. You never know what it can do for you, but always remember that what you do to improve its effectiveness will also um, determine how well the medication works. Any other symptoms with regard to with regards to the medications i have not experienced at all it's just been the fatigue that i had and the lower immune system at the time 
so yeah guys please if there's anyone that is on the medication do support them their immune system is lower it's a lot of stress for them more than they may make it seem so just be there for them and encourage them and and really just walk their journey with them if you're taking the medication i hope you do have your support system that has been the one thing that's gotten me through the past four years and is getting me through the next few years to come this is the year 10 since i was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis 10 years and i am very functional i am happy or oh, oh, definitely much happier than I used to be. <laughs> Very um, starting new adventures in my life, finished my studies, and really just enjoying life. So having MS is not a deal breaker to living life. It's just something that that tells you how to better or improve a situation, how to help people improve their situations as well. So I want you to use this period of being on Maventlad to learn that about yourself, see what's good, what's not good, and help other people who are on this journey to better their life as well. All right, guys, we will continue with more biokinetics videos in the future and some more MS videos as well. I hope you guys have a lovely day. I will see you soon with another video on Reignite Health. Bye. <sighs> Sorry, allergies. But um, thanks, guys, for watching. If you want to see more videos, do click on one of them over here. Or if you want to see my channel, do click on the little round thingy at the bottom of this this page thing all right guys i will definitely see you soon with a new video about my life my journey or health condition enjoy hop on board subscribe i'll see you guys soon bye